Hello out there once again. Right, you may remember my Corgi and Hot Wheels Porsche Carrera. Well, once again, Hot Wheels has actually sold off one of their castings. Now, the original American Ambulance came out in 1986. That looks like 80... Yeah, 86. Again, this is the original American Ambulance. I have seen that it did come to a final run, which is a shame because there has been a lot of these. Again, it was a fun little car to play with. Again, the back doors opened, which was quite interesting and brilliant. However, Meso have brought the original casting. But, unlike what Hot Wheels did, they have made quite a few changes to say, no, it's a new ambulance line from us. Well, sorry Meso, but when you have the almost exact same likeness as the Hot Wheels car, you have to question it. So, what are the similarities? Well, side to side... I would pretty much say they are exactly the same side to side. The front, however, is where it starts to change. The Meso one has slightly different lights, as in the lights are a bit smaller. See there? Slightly smaller, whereas the Hot Wheels one has bigger lights. The top has changed not very much, both the same, and as well as that, they've added a rear windscreen, a mirror, and some wiper blades. Not very useful rear wing mirror, as you can see, there's the casting bit for that underneath it. On top, they've added a roof bar, or another roof uh, air ventilator compared to the Hot Wheels one, which is this one. On the back, they have still got the same opening doors. Lights have changed a bit though. As you can see, they've now only got the two lights, whereas the Hot Wheels one had quite a few lights. Interiors. Now then, the Meso one has the exact same interior as the Hot Wheels one. I kid you not. Again, bed, seat, little box and stethoscope. Hot Wheels one, as you can see, exactly the same. It's only really when we come to the base unit. Now again, the original Hot Wheels one has the big Hot Wheels logo, Mattel, Mattel, Inc. China 86. The Maisto one, well, it actually has quite a good layout. Whereas the Hot Wheels one sort of looks like it could go drag racing because it has sort of like a very good engine bay, this one has a more simpler basic engine. Again, just to show you. There's not a lot of difference, but again, these two are definitely almost the same casting. Again, the Meso guys have done a good job. I'll admit it threw me a bit. I did look at it and say, that's a Hot Wheels, isn't it? But no, it was Meso. That's what immediately grabbed me to it. I thought, ooh, better condition of my original ambulance. Hang on, different wheels. Error? No, it's a Meso. What? Like when I found the Corgi car, that was exactly the same as the Porsche. Had to buy it and show you. Again, always look out for cheap cars. Again, when the final run of sort of like Hot Wheels comes, what do they do with the old castings? Well, they sell them off to cheaper companies. Again, Hot Wheels don't really have a good line for the ambulances. Again, not a lot of collectors out there. Unless you're a van guy, you're not really going to collect ambulances, are you? They made different makes, but, well, you might as well go with the van on that. The other thing as well is the fact that Meso, more cheaper toys for little kids. Now, little kids love to play with sort of like ambulances and stuff. Perfect casting. And because they can't rip off uh, Matchbox or anybody else, well, Hot Wheels sell them in a casting. 
And once again, the ambulance lives on in a new generation or a new life. I will say one thing, though. Meso have done very well. Again, cheap little toy company car, and this is just brilliant. You've done very well, Meso. Just don't make any other cars like this. Again, I have keen eyes. Again, when I spotted this, I thought, like I said, that it was a Hot Wheels. But, nope. Again, it is very sad to see this. Because, is that going to happen to all Hot Wheels cars? Will it come to a certain point when um, the GMC van, the GMC motorhome, when that comes to an end with Hot Wheels? Does that also go to uh, a cheaper car company who just basically uh, fill in the top and just basically make it look different? Don't know. I will say though, it's a very convincing cast. It certainly, when you do pair them up together, when you do sort of put them together, they do sort of look like brother and sister. But again, you wouldn't really care because you're playing with them. So, unless you are a dedicated collector, you would see the difference. I'm not a dedicated collector, just a collector. Again, I just spotted that and I just wanted to point it out to you lot at home. Again, if you are rummaging through toy cars or collections, always keep an eye out for cheaper cars. Don't always go for sort of like your specific kind, like Matchbox or Corgi or whatever. Always have a look at different cars. Because... You never know. You might pick one car up and find the exact same but under a different name. Again, if I do find any more, that'll be the third one. And if I do have to make a third video, I don't know. I mean, I could find something else. But again, thanks for watching and see you again soon.